Welcome back guys, I'm Trooper Weekly, and today we are, gonna, we are going to be doing a new tutorial. Right? This tutorial is going to show you how to replace your sirens for GTA San Andreas. Right? First thing that you want to do is you want to go and head over to my website, TrooperWeeklyMods.BubbleApps.io. What you do here, what you want to do, you want to scroll down, you want to go to Tools. Once you're down at tools, you want to scroll down until you find this this tool right here. Okay, you want to download this tool and you want to make sure you have WinWire installed because it's a dot rare fire rare rare file file. My bad, I can't speak. It's like almost twelve o'clock in the morning. <laughs> so I'm just going to download it. All right, once it's downloading it, we're going to try to open it up. Okay. Now let's say. You already have the sign that you want to do, great. But if you don't have any sirens, what you can do, you can go here to sirens. Alright, and I have a couple different sirens that are in here. Alright, they're free to download. All the mods and everything I put in my website are 100% free to download for you, just for y'all guys. Okay. Anyway, let's go and open this up. And yes, you're gonna see multiple.exes, okay? Don't get confused. You wanna click on this one right there, right? Now, one of you open it, it's gonna ask you to find a new directory, okay? That's fine. All you gotta do is go to where your GTA SA folder is. Since mine's on a desktop, I'm gonna just go to, of course, me. Then I'm gonna go to GTA San Andreas and click OK. And that's gonna give me uh but it's gonna be butthead this time. Okay. <coughs> that work. Now once you're done doing that, you wanna scroll down to general. Open that up. I'm gonna click yes. Okay. And each bake has multiple sound waves. Alright, these are all these sound waves of um what the vehicles go go off of okay now since you want to change the siren you want to scroll all the way down until you see bank underscore zero six eight that's where the fire truck and the police signer are right and it's going to be sound wave 11 and 12. i already have to, i already have custom siren from stall okay so just for this video let's go ahead and install the chp emitter Open it up. Alright, then I'll, I even put it in there of which bank to install it in. Okay. Extract this from the desktop. Alright, now what you want to do, you want to go ahead and click replace up here. Okay. You want to scroll to, you want to go to the folder that you have your siren on. Alright, since we just installed the CHP emitter, it's going to be in the desktop. And we are changing Soundwave 11. So make sure you pay attention to what sound wave you're going to be replacing it with. All right. Do the same thing for sound 11. Oh, my bad. And that's pretty much it. And once you're done, all you got to do is click save. Me, I'm not going to click save because I'm not. I don't want to save this siren. It's just for the tutorial. All right. But once you click save, it'll save the siren to your GTA Sendrays. And this does work in your MTA and SAMP. Alright. It works for both of them, even your base game it works for. Okay. Anyway, hope you guys liked the tutorial. Be sure to subscribe, like, and comment. And I will leave all the links down in the description, so be sure to check that out as well. As I know that, hope you guys liked the video, and I'm out. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go.